Hey YouTubers, say hello. Hi. Got Sean or Dad here, and we got Young Tyler, and we're going to go out for a spot of metal detecting today. So we've come down to one of our little local school playgrounds, and uh, we're going to see what we can do. So come along and enjoy our adventure. Hopefully we'll get some nice finds, and we're going to visit what about two or three parks. Yeah, and I promised him, whatever I found money-wise, I'd go halves with him. So, keep watching, guys. Alright, so we've got our first target here. Numbers are a 62. We swiped a little bit with a coil, and we can see it right down the end there. Let's have a look, Tyler. What is it? 20 cent. Show us. Fantastic. 20 Super cents. clean. Super clean too, apparently. Yeah. Keep on going. So Tyler's got another target down here. We decided to dig it because it was a strong high 60s. Done a bit of a swipe. What have we got, Tyler? 20 cents. Another 20 cents for your money box. And it's super clean again. It's super clean again, apparently. Keep on going. Okay, guys, we've got another target and it's sounds like a 76 and that means it's a... It's a two dollar. What is it? Two dollar. Wow, really? Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Good job, Tyler. Thumbs up, man. Keep on going. Alrighty. We've had a bit of an unusual target here. Yeah, it comes up between 76 and 80. Uh, a little bit of a squirrely target, so I thought we'd give it a dig anyway. Um, usually we have a fair bit of luck with uh, bits and pieces down in this little area here. And check out what we've got guys. Looks like we've got a, a little sort of birdie amulet. A dog tag. Or a dog tag as Tyler just said. On a little chain. I'll just give you a better look. Right there. See if we can get out of the shadows. There you go, look at that. That's on one of those little sort of regular ball chains. Good find. Keep on going. Alright, we've got a signal between 79 and 80. Fairly consistent signal. So, had a good feeling it wasn't going to be rubbish and we decided to dig it anyway. Gave it a bit of a swipe with a coil. Check out what we've got here. A mini coffee cup. Uh, he reckons it's a mini coffee cup. I reckon it's some sort of little charm. I don't think it's silver. I think it's just steel. But it's a cool find all the same. Keep on going. Alright. So young Tyler's had a fair bit of luck. Down at this little local park that we're at. What you find's down there, Tyler? Let's show everyone what you got. Oh, fantastic. I think around $2 worth of fines. So he can put him in his little money box and save him up. And his granddad says if he saves and fills up the money box, granddad will double whatever he makes in that money box. You're going to be rich, aren't you, Tyler? Yes. Thumbs up, man. And guess how much I'm going to get when I, ha when I double them up? How much? I will get... Yeah, quick. Sixty-two dollars when that granddad doubled my my notes up. Oh, fantastic! All right, we're off to the next location. Keep on going. Alrighty, so we're at our new location, which is one of my old haunts, and I haven't detected here for a good four or five months. We've had a fair bit of uh, sports here and uh, footy and practice and stuff, so. Uh, yeah, I'll give it another detect and see how we go. Unfortunately, we had a little bit of a calamity on the way over here. Poor young Tyler lost his trainer wheel. That's going to be fun getting him home. We're probably about four or five k's away from home. Tyler can't really ride just yet without his trainer wheels. And you'll see from here, guys, it's... Unfortunately, it's completely shattered through. 
So I don't know what we're going to do here. Oh, we'll have to give it a try and see how we go. Anyway, I'm going to hit the play equipments and then hit the oval for a little while. We were going to go to a third location, but uh, that's probably about another 5 k's away. And it's going to be difficult enough to get back with Tyler with only one training wheel. But it doesn't matter, it's all part and parcel of the day. And we're having an absolutely fantastic day anyway. Keep on going. Okay, so another sweet target. 79. It was throwing off a little bit false. As you can see, I dug a bit of a plug down here. If you move over a bit. Check it out, guys. It's another Goldie. Fantastic. Love the spendables. And what's this one? World War coin. Beauty. Keep on going. Okay. Right next to where we dug that dollar, which was down here. Obviously, we filled it in. We got another bit of an unusual target. This one's got me a little bit excited. Let's grab it. Let's have a look. Hang on. Leave it be. Daddy, grab it in case it's caught. Beautiful. Well, they look like little amethysts. Please excuse the focus there, guys. You can see there, it is attached to a chain. Just carefully pull the chain out. There we go, we've got it out. Seems like the entire thing's intact. Don't know if it's gold or not. Looking at the back here, um, the rough appearance of it there, I don't believe it's real gold. But it's a beautiful little necklace all the same. Woohoo! Thumbs up, Tyler. When she focuses, woohoo! Keep on going. No, right. we're going to the volcano. Another park. little plug. Right. Another goldie. Woohoo! Gotta love the goldies. And a couple of other fantastic finds there as well, guys. Please excuse the focus today. Don't know what's going on with this thing. Keep on going. Gonna have to call this dig quits. Or call it quits on this dig as it'd be. Because uh, we've had a couple little mishaps here and there. Nothing too great. Young Tyler lost his trainer wheel on his bike. Because he's still got to work out that balance thing yet. Uh, but the main reason why we've got to call it quits is a couple of weeks ago. I went on an urban hunt. And stupid me went and left my digger at the hunt. Of course, being an urban area, I raced back down there to get it when I'd realised, but it was gone. So Garrett Australia, or Garrett America, I'm a very big Garrett fan. I've actually got quite a few of my friends that have purchased Garrett's. And, uh, yeah, I find them a really great machine. So if you feel like donating a digger to me, I'll be happy to advertise you guys on the on the page or on the on the videos, and uh, yeah, that'd be fantastic. But see, the issue here I've got is I went and replaced it with this digger here. Now it's a Saxon brand digger. It's not a bad digger. It's good for doing soft uh, sort of areas and uh, doing sod, like really soft sod, really soft grass areas. But here's the problem. It bends super easy. Where we're actually digging at the moment, the ground is as hard as a rock. So unfortunately I've got lots and lots of targets that we can't dig because I just simply can't get into them. I haven't got the right tools. So I hope you enjoyed the video anyway. As I said, we had a really great day, didn't we Tyler? You're starting to get a bit bored yourself now, aren't you? So we might go past the shops and grab a drink and some chips. What do you reckon? Yeah. Yeah? I'm and, really tired. Oh, and he's really tired too. So, And it has been a big day. Little fella's probably ridden about 6 or 7 k's at the moment on his little bike. So he's done really well and I'm really proud of you. And that's it. Nothing more we can really do. Pack up.
and head home. So I will include a bit of a roundup video at the end of uh, this section here, just to show you some of the finds that we've got off video, where I've either dug them up and I've forgotten to record, but I've had a couple of really great little finds. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed mine, Sean and Tyler's company. And we look forward to your comments. And as always, guys, if you do like the video, give us a like. What do you reckon, Tyler? Should they push the like button? Yeah. And again, if you like my content and my videos, feel free to subscribe. Not pushing you or anything, but it'd be really great if you did subscribe. All right, take it easy, guys. And I'll see you on the roundup. Bye. Bye. Here's Coffee, the famous YouTube chicken. Say hello, Coffee. And here's the roundup, guys. Now we got six, seven, eight, nine dollars worth of spendables. Now I thought these were actually going to be spendables, but uh, turns out. They're actually New Zealand dollars, so we can't spend them over here. You see, same as this one here, guys. It's also a New Zealand one. We got this beautiful little pendant over here. That looks really cool. I think the kids will like that. We got a little dragonfly now. I thought this was a really great find. Fortunately, didn't get this and a few of the others on the camera. But uh, yeah show you on the roundup. Now we got this thing here which turns out it's a necklace or a, not a necklace sorry a little bracelet a little thing there kind of looks like one of those Pandora ones but I don't know the quality is not as great as what a Pandora usually is so I think it might just be a little cheap one. Shut up coffee I'm recording a video say hello to the viewers <laughs> This is my gorgeous little chicken, guys. Aren't you, coffee? Hey? And for the rest of them, guys, got this really cool little costume ring. If it'll let me get a nice focus there. It's just a little brass ring with little fake stones in it. That's pretty cool. Little charm here. Uh, not real. None of it's real, unfortunately. Be nice. Got the old bandage holder here. Now this beautiful little find here. Now, I don't know about this one. They look like real little amethysts in there. Um, they're not silvered on the back or anything. It's a beautiful little find. I haven't really checked for a hallmark. Give me a second. I'll have a look, see if it's got a hallmark. Well, it doesn't seem to have a hallmark on it, so I think it's just a little costume piece as well. And the final one, which I thought was really cool. I've actually found one of these before. Uh, it's a little, I think it's stainless. I don't know. It might be silver, but I reckon it's stainless. It's got little crosses on it. And it's actually one of the spinner rings. So you can spin it backwards and forwards like that. So I really hope you enjoyed today's video. And... Uh, yeah, Tyler and I had real great time. Turns out the poor little bugger ended up losing his second trainer wheel on the bike on the way home. So we pretty much just had to walk about three or four k's to get home. And uh, I'll look at getting that fixed as soon as I can. Poor little bugger just hasn't worked out his balance yet. Hope you enjoy the video. Sorry if it's a little bit of a longer video today. And uh, yeah, as always, if you like the video, Smash the like button, and if you like my content, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Take care, and shoot around.